Hi, it's Barton Jennings here from Lone Sleep. Just got an x-ray and CT scan here to show you. This is the x-ray, which is a picture taken from the front with the lungs in here, heart in the middle, diaphragms here. The diaphragms look quite nice and clear there. And this patient's presented with fever. And we can see there's an abnormality on the chest x-ray just in here, which looks like a rounded area of abnormality, probably in the lower lobe of the lung. We can get more details if we look across at the CT scan. And we start off with the lung windows. This is now scanning through the chest. So the front is here, the back is here with the vertebra, trachea in the middle, and the lungs are here. Most of these white dots within the lungs are blood vessels, with a little bit of nodular change at the apices of the lung. We're just scanning down through the chest now. As we come down here, we can see that there's some areas of bronchiectasis with thickened bronchi here. A little bit of pleural change there. And here there's a little bit of nodular change which looks sort of like tree and bud, which is mucus impacted in small airways. It sort of seems to be branching. It's usually suggestive of infection. As we come down here, there's a little bit more nodular change here. This is in the right middle lobe. We're starting to come into the abnormality here, posteriorly in the right lower lobe, with increased whiteness. And as we go more inferior, it becomes denser. So there's a much denser abnormality in the lung here. However, there's still some airways in there. So we can see some air bronchograms coursing through there. Um, and you see the air, air bronchograms through there, and it's a bit of fluffy change. It's quite consistent with consolidation due to infection, extending down to the base there. So this abnormality here certainly explains the abnormality on the chest extra. Um, and there's also some scattered inflammatory change, some areas of thick and dilated bronchi, a few here, showing that there's underlying bronchiectasis. If we just quickly have a look at the mediastinal windows, this is just changing the color from black and white to different black and white. Gives us an idea that there's a few little enlarged lymph nodes here, which in the setting of infection are almost certainly inflammatory or reactive to the infection. And if we go down to the main area of consolidation, we can see here that the, the, these white areas are blood vessels coursing through that area of consolidation, which is once again also consistent with consolidation. It certainly does not look like a solid mass or a cancer, but it will be important to repeat the x ray or the scan following antibiotic therapy to ensure that all resolves. So hopefully that's useful, uh, showing a demonstration of a patient with pneumonia.